Uh, I'm Dan Miller. I'm a general thoracic surgeon from Atlanta, Georgia. Um, at this year's uh, European STS meeting, uh, representing the STS. Uh, I've had a long relationship uh, with the STS and the European STS, and it's great to be here in, in, in The Hague. Uh, what I'm looking forward to in the future is our collaboration, especially in regards to evidence-based medicine. Uh, as you know, both of us have been involved in our prospective uh, databases uh, for the last 20 years. And I think it's very important as we go forward that we combine these databases into doing uh, future studies, the most important thing in regards to quality of our patients undergoing uh, cancer operations such as lung cancer and esophageal cancer. So I'm looking forward to us coming together more as colleagues and because of the electronic uh, databases, we can do that and do evidence-based studies so we can improve the quality of our, of our patients' outcomes. Okay, and uh, could you please tell us a few things about the future activities of uh, the society? Uh, uh, for us, um, I, you know, as we expand, I think it will be very important for the STS and the European STS to help work on quality measures, especially in like, uh, we started years ago the STS University, which is a hands-on um, program uh, at our meeting. And I think if we can do that with the European society, that would help out quality. With new um, interventions, uh, robotic surgery, um, complex VAT surgery, and also new modalities such as pain management. And I think as we work together, um, that will help to improve the quality. Also, too, uh, for us to have regional courses uh, or within different nations within Europe, and that way when our members cannot go to the meeting, um, that they can, we can come to them to help them learn new technologies and also uh, cost-saving maneuvers. Also, in, in working together with the two societies, the most important thing is lung cancer screening. Uh, the U.S. has been involved in lung cancer screening for almost two decades now, and I think as it increases in Europe, uh, that we can help you work through the, the issues that occur with lung cancer screening, uh, such as compliance, uh, what patients to screen, and so forth. And with that way, we can find um, earlier lung cancer and better survival. Also, too, the most important thing is smoking cessation. So if we can work together on tobacco control, uh, other environmental um, hazards that can lead to lung cancer will be very important as we continue to fight and, and to cure lung cancer.